So next we're going to take you through our ankle cars and Josh is going to be doing these seated on the ground. If this position that he sets up in feels um, unattainable due to too, tightness, too much tightness in the hip flexors, uh, too much tightness in the hamstrings, you could do this exercise seated on a chair and just extend your leg under in front of you so you don't have to be braced in the way that he is. So he's going to go ahead and set up, he's going to hook underneath his thigh, then he's going to take his other hand and brace it onto his shin. So what we're trying to avoid, or what he's trying to pay attention to with the hand on the shin, is that when he circles his ankle around, that the shin bone isn't moving inward and outward because that would mean that his knee is also doing some work. So we want to really isolate just through that ankle. So he's just going to keep a little eye on it with his hand there. So we're going to start in full flexion, so he's going to pull all five toes up toward his face, and then we're going to start to circle around, we'll lead toward that pinky toe first. So he's reaching outward toward that pinky toe as much as he can, and then continuing that circle down and toward the floor, so he's in as much extension as he can, and then as if that uh, big toe is on a straight, he's pulling it out and forward, it should feel a nice stretch through the outside of the ankle, until he comes all the way back up, all five toes back toward him, same direction. So he's going to go toward that pinky toe again. You want to imagine like your foot is a rubber spatula and you're trying to scrape out a bowl. So he's really hitting every angle. Internal there, feeling a nice stretch to the outside of the ankle and then pulling up and in, finishing all five toes toward his face. And then he'll go in the other direction for two reps. Down toward that floor, really being conscious that as he goes through that circle that that shin is staying perfectly stable. One final circle, so you should feel, be feeling probably quite a bit of burn through the outside of that shin. And then all five toes will lift up and then relax. So we'll do the same thing on the left foot. Great job.